Welcome to Building Safety Month, week four, water safety. We're at the city of Broomfield water treatment plant where they process millions of gallons of water on a daily basis. My name is Mark Remy. I'm with the Division of Fire Prevention and Control for the state of Colorado. And we're gonna drill down to how we're gonna get safe water into your home. Today, we're discussing water safety with Gabriel Ortiz with the city of Broomfield. Gabriel, tell us what role you play in water safety for the residents of Broomfield. Yeah, hi Mark. I am the building inspector supervisor for the city of Broomfield. Tell us with the city of Broomfield building department, who plays a role in providing water safety? We have our chief building official, we have our plans examiners, uh, we have our permit techs, and then lastly we have our inspectors that go out in the field and verify that everything's uh, code compliant. So we're here in a multi-family uh, building in a riser room, what it's called. Um, we have a couple of backflow preventers in here um, that are very critical to maintaining uh, water safety. Um, the first one here is for domestic water. Um, these are tested. They're, uh, um, the builders are made to provide certifications that, that these work correctly. Uh, behind me, we also have one uh, for fire. Um, on the fire side, um, fire typically uh, does their inspections on those and, and has their criteria of what is needed on those. These are very critical in keeping our water safe. Uh, they allow water flow to go one way but not back backwards. Uh, and the reason why is we don't want that water to be contaminated uh, to the whole system. Okay. Gabriel, we're at the water treatment plant city of Broomfield where they process millions of gallons of water every day. Uh, tell us, once it gets into someone's home or into their business when we're talking hundreds or thousands of gallons of water, what are you doing to protect the water at that level? Yeah, so obviously we want to keep this, this big process that they have going um, safe all the way through. It's also critical that we don't allow that water to get contaminated outside the system and to come back into the system. So we look at things as backflows, faucets, shower heads, all that has to have preventative devices to prevent contamination of that, that water. How critical is it for us as homeowners to, to pay attention to that? It's, it's very critical. Um, I mean, we do, what we have to for the builders to make sure that they're complying with these code requirements, these minimum code requirements. But homeowners can take it a step further. Um, just being aware, like don't over fertilize uh, your lawn, um, consumption of how much water they use, uh, what they allow down their drains. A lot of people think, um, you know, drainage is just wasted water, but actually that goes back into streams and really into back into your water system. Uh, my name is Rick Bednar. I'm the water treatment superintendent for the city and county of Broomfield. I've been here since 2014. Um, I've been in the water and wastewater field for 44 years. Here at the water treatment facility, we treat just shy of 2 billion gallons of water a year, deliver about 3 billion. We uh, are supplemented by Denver water with um, about a third of, of the demand in the in the city of Broomfield. Um, we get our water from Carter Lake, which is snowmelt runoff um, through a 48 mile pipeline to a terminal reservoir up here at the treatment plant. Um, from there, we, we treat it with chemicals um, for coagulation and flocculation. Um, we run it through sedimentation basins, uh, which settles out the, the majority of the particles um, into sludge on the bottom. And from there, the water then goes through filtration. Um, and then it goes into our clear well, um, where it is disinfected. Uh, we add fluoride and we pump it out with high service pumps to the distribution system in the city. 
thanks to everybody that's been a part of this process and helping us to better understand how the city of Broomfield provides safe water for the residents, those that live, play, and work in the city of Broomfield. It's been a great process all the way from the water treatment plant to the building department, engineering, and how they get water into the, the homes in the city of Broomfield. Thanks for joining us.